Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of Cuphead. Last episode we took care of the final uh, boss and the final run and gun level uh, in Inkwell Isle 3, so now we have reached the final area of Cuphead. We have two bosses t to uh, take care of today. Uh, King Dice, and then the final boss against the devil himself. So, first things first, we gotta try our luck at King Dice's game, and I'll explain it as we go along, just in case for those that haven't played Cuphead. Let's do this. My lineup is set. Well, looky here, you actually pulled it off, but you've made me lose a bet. And for that, you ain't seeing the boss just yet. We're gonna play a little game first. Oh boy. So, there is a little bit of luck involved with King Dice's game. You'll see momentarily. <sighs> Alright, so, we have a little game board and the pink dice I have to parry. If I land on a spot with a heart, for example, I get an uh, extra life. Uh, well, I get an extra heart to my health, but I still have to face a boss. Uh, the safe zones are uh, 12 for 1, 6 for 1, and 18 for 1. And, of course, right before the end of the board, there is a start over, which will force you to go back to the very beginning. And you'll, pro you'll most likely have to uh, face off against more bosses. And that pretty much does it for explaining the rules. So, um, I'm going to try and get a three to get a heart. Alright, so, we have four health now, but now we have to face off against a boss. And the problem is, I don't remember the order of these bosses. A lot of them are casino related. A brawl is surely brewing. Oh, of course this one isn't though. Oh crap. This one's an easy one too. I <sighs> It's a bit of a back and forth game as you can see the cigar can go from one side to the other. This is probably the easiest one. You just gotta watch the spinning. You have plenty of time to react so you can change sides from one side to another. I also changed my uh, layout. This is the, uh, this attack is uh, a weak attack but you don't have to aim, it automatically will hit the enemy, guaranteed. I'm starting to regret picking this though, cause... The... <sighs> the stupid cigar... <sighs> Alright, I thought the cigar was, uh... Seemed to have an unusual amount of health, but then again, this does below average damage, so... We'll try the roundabout this time. Oh, wait, I forgot. You can't just retry the boss. You have to s completely start over if you fail. Okay, well, I'm gonna get a three again. I hope. Okay, so this time around, I have the roundabout attack. This should be fine this time. Now that I, uh, I'm warming myself up again to this uh, game board of bosses. We're doing much better this time around. No damage taken. Just yet. <sighs> of course... I forget what you're supposed to do with that trick when he sends out the two little spinning things. Well, that's alright. The defeated animation is King Dice stomping out the, cig the cigar. And now we can move on with the uh, game board. I don't know how many I, I need to get the next bit of health, though. Oh, it's another three. Okay, um... Looks like I'm trying to get another three, even though I have no clue what the next boss is. I don't remember. <gasps> Wait. 
perfect. Okay. We're doing good so far with our timing. What are we facing now, though? Oh, the rabbit. Okay, this one's not too bad. You have plenty of time to react. I, for I forget how you're supposed to dodge that, though. Uh. Oh. Oh, wait. Perfect. Go from the bottom up. Ah, uh, it's this again. Oh, good thing I <laughs> defeated the rabbit in time. That skull would have hit me if I didn't. All right, so we're doing good. Um, what do I want now, though, on this board? All right, another three. Let's do it. Three, three. Wait. Perfect. I'm doing good. Uh, this is my uh, second time around doing this, even though it's been a while since I've done it the first time. What do you got for me now? Oh, okay. This one, from what I remember, is very easy as long as you have the smoke screen ability. Uh, we'll go this way. Oh yeah, this is very easy. Don't overthink it and think you have to parry the uh, the chips. You don't really have to. Too easy. Thank you for the free bit of health, King Dice. Um, I think I need another three though to get a safe space. I think. Oh yes, I do. All right, so I need to get a three to land on the safe space. And then I need a two to get to the end of this board and face off against King Dice. Luck don't fail me now. <gasps> well, my luck ran out. But it's alright. Let's see what we have to face. <gasps> oh, there's a trick to this too. If you like... I forget what you're, you're supposed to do. I think you, you have to, like, match the two cards when the monkey is at the corner of the screen or something, and then it's an automatic knockout. I forget how to do that trick. So now I have to actually do this actual boss. Oh. Crap. Moves pretty quickly, too, around the screen. I'm not trying to risk taking any damage right now. Oh, crap! Ugh. Alright, um. Uh, nope, that's not a match. That's not a match. I should have been paying attention. I wasn't. Uh, oh, this was a match. Oh, if I only knew the trick on how to beat this. It, it, it like, last 10 sec. This boss battle will have lasted 10 seconds at the most. If I knew the trick. Nope. Nope. Wait, that was Mugman. Nope, that's Cuphead. Uh. Wait, was it here? It was. You know what, let's do this. Maybe this will help. Um, nope. Oh, here's Cuphead. Wait, I know where it is. I hate that I have to play this normally, because this is taking forever. Alright, so there's the dice. How much health do you have, monkey? 
Do I have to match all the cards? I... I think I do. As annoying as it may be. Alright, here's the last two. Please tell me it's an automatic end. Nope. I have to defeat it now. <sighs> Make your way over here, please. There we go. That boss battle would have taken, like, under 30 seconds. Like, 10 seconds max if I knew the trick. You had to, like, match it. Like, get a quick match as he's in the corner or something like that. I forget how the trick works, but it doesn't matter. I need to get a 3 or 1. I cannot get a 2. Otherwise, I have to do this board all over again. Three. I, I see he changed the order of the dice, too, to mess with me. I noticed that last time, too. I just didn't say anything at the time. So it's one, three, two, one, three, two, one, three, two. Wait. <laughs> I could have sworn I hit a three there, but okay. Whatever. The nice thing, the bittersweet thing to this is that if I can get a three, it's considered a safe space, I think. Let me get try and get a three to hopefully prove this. See, it's considered a safe space now. That's the, it's kind of a bittersweet thing. So I gotta just get another three. Or one. That's okay. It's a safe space. I just need a two. Perfect. Now I need another two. Two or three, actually. Or one. <sighs> Alright, what are we facing? Oh, this one's annoying. You gotta watch the ghost at the bottom. With the horse racing, because he's going to jump up at you. <laughs> Crap. Wait, you can't get too low, though, because the horses are going to hit you. You got to, like, find your balance. I'm not liking where this is going, though. <laughs> now I have to start over. Of course, I was one hit away, too, on top of it, just because... Add a little bit more difficulty on top of what I've, uh, experienced. So now the board completely resets. And now I start from the very beginning. I was doing so well, too. First try. Of course, I screw it up at the end. <sighs> Alright, so. I got a one. And this is- oh, crap. This is supposed to be- a three-part boss. It's fairly easy. Uh, oh crap! Oh, the three drinks have different attacks. The uh, the martini sends out olives that attack you. The uh, whiskey, I think it is. You just have to watch when it sends out its attack, and then I don't know what the glass in front of it is. I uh. <laughs> That one just spells out like a attack you have to jump. This is the easiest boss. Is well, actually, it's the second easiest. And of course, I die. Couple hits away too on top of it. Just lovely. I'm just embarrassing myself right now, losing to the easier bosses. I I gotta get back on my luck. Of course I get a two. I'm trying to get a three. Now it's messing me all up. I had a rhythm going, and now it's gone. Alright, so we got a stack of chips to face off against. You have to find the gap to dash your way through. Oh! He sort of mixes that up a little bit. Makes it a little bit more difficult, but... For the most part, 
you can uh, find your path e easily to get through. I'm just sticking with the roundabout. Oh crap, I forgot the bottom chip now. Come on, these are the easier bosses. Now, now I'm panicking, thinking I, uh, I'm, g I'm gonna miss a chip. There we go. Just get rid of this stupid set of chips. I'm just embarrassing myself. It shouldn't be this difficult. Uh, this difficult. Oh boy. Later. Well, I haven't been doing so well right now. I'm on my last bit of health. And right now, we are facing off against a new boss. Well, that I've experienced so far. It's uh, a set of dominoes. The annoying thing is you have to keep moving. Otherwise, you'll run into some spikes. Just gotta be very careful as I jump right into a, a diamond. I I knew things weren't going so well anyways, especially with my last bit of health and I wasn't hitting my uh, uh, spots with uh, getting one bit of health back, so it's probably the best thing that uh, I'm, star I'm uh, starting over again. A few moments later. Oh, wow. All right, we've actually got uh, something new to show you. We got the Magic 8-Ball. It's uh, been a while since I've uh, last checked in. It's been about uh, at least 25 minutes of trial and error. A lot of losing to that Domino's boss, specifically. And I haven't been so lucky up to this point ever since my first attempt. This is probably the best I've done since, having all my health. Technically, I did get a bit of health back thanks to a lucky roll, but you get the point. I still have a full set of health. Maybe I'll get a four, hopefully, if I can get lucky enough here. But I need to look at the board to assess the uh, situation I'm in. All right, so I can get one for an extra heart. I can get two for a safe spot. I cannot get a three, otherwise I have to start over again. So basically anything but a three. I've, I've been legit staring at this dice for five minutes, trying to read the patterns, trying to time it out. <sighs> Come on, it's the moment of truth. Just do it. Wait, nothing but a three. Wait, anything but a three. What am I saying? I probably just jinxed myself saying that. Wait. Okay, I thought I hit a three. I was worried for a second. I'll take it, even if I have to play another boss, but I don't know if I played everyone yet on this board. Oh. Of course, we have this stupid boss right here, the most annoying one. Especially because I don't know the trick. I should have looked this up. Uh... I don't know, can I like do it real quick? To trigger the glitch? Wait, uh... Oh, there's Cuphead. I can't believe I'm using my super, but I feel like I have to. Because I don't want to risk losing my health right now for King Dice. <gasps> wow, how did that not hit me? Um, wait, I forget which... <sighs> well, so much for that. Uh, oh, here's a match. I should just skip ahead. This is just too annoying. I defeated the boss, but of course, he took all my health, so 
now I'm at one. And that raises a lot of issues because I'm at the end of the board and there's a chance I have to face King Dice with one bit of health. It's going to take a miracle to beat him if I actually get a three here. Or one. I'm back at the same situation. I cannot get a two. I probably will, though, knowing my luck. You got this. You got this. Just accept what ha whatever happens. Oh, crap. Here we go. <laughs> oh, that's why I needed all my health. Oh. The first thing he does sends out all those cards and you have to parry the pink ones. And oh, I hate this. Now I have to start over again. Oh, it takes so long just to get to the end, too. Well, I'll see you guys once I get back to the end of this board again. Whenever that is. One hour later. Alright, I made it my way back to the end of the board. I, uh, I did okay. I lost a bit of health. That's why I'm at two. Right now, I cannot get a three. I'm looking for a two, hopefully. Let's try our luck again. Wait. <laughs> Don't screw this up. You know what, at least I didn't start over, but... Problem is, I think I have to deal with the monkey again. I looked up how to do the glitch. Let me see if I can try it. Oh, crap. And then you have to, like, move over here. Now that I think about it, that, uh... Maybe they patched the glitch, because... I did get some, uh... The game still gets some updates every once in a while. They probably fixed this glitch by now, and I can't even do it. I'm probably just wasting my time. Um, problem is, I don't remember where any of the other ones are now. Oh, I got lucky that time. This monkey and the dominoes boss. Those two are my least favorite in this lineup. If you're lucky enough to get the, um, oh crap, uh, the roulette table, I think it is, the, the one that's just spins around back and forth, that's the easiest one without a doubt. Then the, the drinks boss, I think that's the first, if you get a one to start off the board, uh, those two are the easiest. Uh... Crap. That's the bad thing. If you don't get a match, he speeds up. Oh, crap. Get ready. <sighs> oh, this stupid monkey. I hate it. Come on. I hate its movement patterns. I hate... The sim how simple the attack is, and yet it still hits me. It's th the monkey itself hits me more than the actual attack. Come on, take him out, take him out, before he bounces his way over here. Come on, get just get this last match. Please. Please, don't screw this up now. You just matched all the stupid cards. Okay, well, good news I beat this again, but bad news is I'm back in the same situation as before. Even if I get to the end and face King Dice, he's probably going to take me out again in a matter of seconds, so... I have to be ready, no matter what happens. <sighs> Part of me thinks starting over won't be as bad, because I have an opportunity to get two hearts back. 
but I'm, I mean, for the sake of this video, I also want to try and finish this boss today, so I'm, I'm a bit torn. We'll let the dice decide, I guess. It's not the end of the world. Let me just get a one. Wait. It's a silver lining. You just gotta find it. <laughs> After restarting this many times, it's uh... It doesn't hurt as much. <laughs> as great as it was to get the heart, I ended up losing it on a cheap shot by one of the stupid drinks. So now I have to work my way towards the seven. Uh, and get the heart there. If I... <laughs> if I screw this up... Alright, I, I basically have free reign uh, right now. I can just get whatever I want. It's all a free spot. It's all a safe spot, is what I'm trying to say. I just have to get a two. Or one. Two ones or a two. Perfect! I cannot afford to take a hit right now, whatever this boss is going to be. Please be something good. Something easy. Please be easy. Yes! Perfect! This is the perfect boss. All you gotta you do is use your smoke screen. This is perfect. Watch the balls, though. That's where she can get her cheap shot at you. It doesn't matter how long this is gonna take me, as long as I don't get hit. That's the important thing. <gasps> oh. <laughs> I had this board in my favor. Everything was going right, and then it all falls apart. Now I start from the beginning again. Oh boy, I just... Oh, this is so tiring. Working your way back from the very beginning. I hate this. I hate this. Oh. Uh. <sighs> Alright guys, I went on an almost perfect run. I missed one heart. I had five health until I got to that dreaded monkey. And he took away both of those extra hearts. So now I'm back to just three. But the good news is I'm going into the King Dice boss battle with uh, three bits of health this time instead of one. So it doesn't matter what we roll. We just got to work our way to the end and get ready to parry the cards. One more time. Wait, I gotta get this ready, the spread. Let's go! Oh, crap! All right, get ready. Oh, I hate the parrying on these stupid cards. I think, I think there's a cheat. Yeah, you can hide behind King Dice. When he does that, but the problem is you can't attack him though. Oh crap. <laughs> I was halfway done too. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is awful. I have to work my way back again. I've been doing this for over an hour now. I think this is this might have to be my last try. If I can't do it, then. I might have to return for a part two. As much as I don't want to, I was hoping I could take care of this boss today, but I just can't. Alright, I made it back with four bits of health this time. Won't make that three. I saved my super just for you, King Dice. Oh! Come on! Take him out quickly! Please, please, please! Please! <gasps> I hate this. I really hate this. Oh! 
I'm so close. I can't quit. I just can't. I... Mm, I gotta switch. Um... Maybe to the lobber. I gotta beat this somehow. I just... I was gonna give up, but I can't. I can't. I'm gonna keep going. A few moments later... Oh my gosh, guys. I nearly gave up on this because my phone nearly died while I was recording this. Oh, I am so glad this is done. This is, uh, King Dice. You could argue that, uh, his boss battle is, uh, even worse than the devil himself. But then again, I'm probably gonna regret saying that. I got a perfect score. Wow. I think that's a... <laughs> Excuse me. I think, uh... I think that's the, the first time in this playthrough I've gotten a perfect score. Perfect. Alright, so... Now that we finally defeated King Dice... What happens now? We unlock the devil's special room over here. Ooh, should I give the devil a try now, or should I just call it quits while I can? You know what? On second thought, let's try the, the devil out. Uh, if I can't beat him today, that's alright. We'll put it off for one more episode. Um, I'm gonna keep this loadout. I think it'll be uh, best for the devil. Let's do this. The final boss in the regular version of Cuphead. All this work, collecting all those soul contracts. Well, 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 look how far you've come. Not only did you bust up my good-for-nothing lackey, King Dice, but I see you've got my soul contracts as agreed. Hand them over and join my team. So, there's technically two endings to this game, if you haven't played it. I'll stick with no for now, and if I can beat the devil today, I'll show you what happens when I say yes. So, let's say no. Welch it on me just like all the others, eh? I'll teach you for backing out of a deal. Have at you. Let's do this. I've made it this far. We gotta finish the job now. Alright, here we go. This is it. The devil has a few different kinds of attacks and on top of it he has his little minions running side to side too you got to be careful of both sides this is his spider form you have to make sure you keep moving because he'll go wherever you land that's his uh, what I like to call the goat clap in that case you can just use oh crap you can, uh, duck, or you can use your smoke screen. I like using the smoke screen ability. It feels easier. Oh wait, which side is he going? This way? <gasps> I forgot he goes all the way across the screen. We nearly finished the first phase, too. Anyone who opposes me will be destroyed. <sighs> Not if I have anything to say about it. Even though I can't really talk, I just died. Alright, you literally have to get behind this pillar and hide. Oh crap! His goat clap is really quick. Luckily the bubbles bounce randomly. Oh crap, I jumped right into it! Okay. I think I should try the, uh, spread out. Alright, good start. I nearly saw that at the last second. Oh, crap, he's going this way. C 
Come on, devil. You're not doing anything. Go clap. Oh, I jumped right into the minion. Oh, crap. I forgot about this phase. That one's annoying, too, because it spins back and forth. <sighs> Gotta keep it going. Let's keep this going. Oh, I hate this phase. Oh, I escaped. Oh, crap. Look at all the stuff flying around. How am I supposed to dodge all of it at once? <laughs> all right, here comes the dragon. It's coming this side. Destroy the minion. I still got it hit by the devil come on <gasps> of course I keep getting that close to getting to the next phase but I can't oh I can't finish the job I just realized you can't duck the the go clap you can only dash in midair so there's a uh, lessons learned there I messed up. My bad. Come on, devil. Stupid go clap. Get out of here. Oh, here comes my favorite phase. Oh. I want to use my super, but it's, it'd be a better decision to save it. I have no choice. I have to do it now to try and get some progress. There we go. We are now entering the second phase. You hop down here, follow the devil all the way down. And he's supersized now. You gotta parry the pink bombs quickly. Otherwise they explode. Oh, and the flying axe. <laughs> Oh, the axe scared me off my platform. I hate this so much. <sighs> but we're at the end. I can't give up. Alright, we did a good job in the first phase this time around. We have all our health. We're going down now. We should be in a better spot than before. Oh, good thing I used my super. Wait. Crap. Alright, it's okay. We still have two bits of health. <gasps> oh. P please. Yes. Come on. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. All right. We're at the next phase now. The devil is extra mad now. Oh, crap. He's going to take away two of the platforms, which blow. And on top of it, he adds these little guys. I don't remember the bats, though. That's new to me. Why didn't the bats show up the first time? <gasps> Ooh. <gasps> Crap. I don't remember those little flying things. Is that a part of an update? Of course, we were at the final bit, too. We were almost there to the final phase. Ugh. Now I have to deal with these little birds on top of the two, the two pink big guys sending out the skeletons <sighs> I can do this I've done it before I beat the game before I can do it again well that doesn't help it doesn't help that you send out my most annoying phase out first oh crap I made it back but with one bit of health again, it's gonna take a miracle. Especially with these bats! <sighs> this, and the stupid poker chips falling down too on top of it. Oh my gosh. The devil and uh, King Dice, they're, they're equals in their own way. W one's not more difficult than the other. Who am I kidding? I gotta give the devil the respect he deserves in the game. Can't take that out of context. Alright, we're back with two bits of health this time. One more than before. And I'm about to get my super. I'm gonna wait. 
Good thing I did it now. Oh, I spoke too soon there. <laughs> Those stupid bats do a blade attack? Uh, why don't I remember those little blue guys? The bluebirds, what? This wasn't part of an update, was it? That I don't... No, they would have said something. That... I must have just forgotten about those blue birds. They must have not caused uh, uh, enough of an issue for me. Oh, I'm, I'm nearly losing my voice. <laughs> What am I supposed to do, honestly, with that the flame still flying around, and then on top of it, he does the goat clap? I... What could I possibly do? I... I just don't get that part. <sighs> Maybe I should take out the pink guys first. And then... Focus on the devil. Alright. Oh, wait! Wait, what got me? <gasps> well, falling off the edge got me. Oh, I just keep getting so close. Oh, just keep it going. I gotta keep this going. A few moments later. <gasps> yes! Oh my gosh, guys, I finally did it. It took so long for me to beat the devil. Just as long as King Dice. But I finally did it. And we have now finally completed Cuphead. The the main island, not the DLC island. We'll get to that uh, in a future episode. Let's wrap this story up now. What a relief. Oh, uh, what a run. I... <laughs> oh boy, it's, it's mentally exhausting. Uh... The brothers had triumphed over the demon, forcing him to finally give up. We shall accept your surrender, devil, Cuphead laughed, but we're not done just yet. And with that, Cuphead and Mugman destroyed all of the soul contracts, releasing Inkwill Isle's res residence from eternal servitude to the devil. Gosh, I can't wait to tell everybody, Cuphead said. The boys set off for home and at top speed. Come on, last one there's a leaky cup, Mugman teased as they ran. Even though Cuphead was running ahead of him. Once home, the brothers gathered everyone together. You're all free of the devil's debt, Cuphead announced. And that fiend won't bother us again, Mugman added. The Elder Kettle was literally brimming with pride as everyone began to cheer. Let's hear it for Cuphead and Mugman. Hip hip hurrah! Hip hip hurrah! As, oh, there you go. As an all-day celebration began, the brothers promised to never wander into trouble again. And they didn't. Until the next time, of course. But that's another story. See, that was a nice way to end Cuphead originally. It left open the possibility of a Cuphead 2 or DLC. And Cuphead chose DLC, so... Uh, now we have the DLC island to look forward to, but as great as this game was to revisit, I will be taking a break from this game for the rest of this week, uh, mainly because Fall Guys Season 10 is coming out on Wednesday, so I'm gonna do a few videos on that for the rest of the week, and then I'll return next week to start the DLC island. And we will go from there. Boy, uh, <laughs> it brought back some, uh, some good memories and some bad ones. One being that, uh, it took me all day to complete certain bosses. Uh, the final two bosses being one of them. Well, two of them, I should say. And Dr. Cal's robot, of course. That took me a whole day to complete. And, uh, from what I remember, uh, everything else was fairly, uh, balanced. I'll put it that way. And this time around, doing this second playthrough, it was nice to have the DLC island abilities like the crack shot and 
Um, the auto-aiming one that I tried but failed. It, it does too little damage to my liking. I, I like to be somewhat aggressive but strategic at the same time. <sighs> Alright, I'm gonna cut this short just in case my phone dies again. Um, I've been recording for that long. I haven't recorded this long in, uh... This is probably the longest I've recorded a video for my channel, so... I'll just leave it at that before I start rambling. Um, I'll just remind you guys one more time. Next week, I will start DLC Island. Uh, the rest of this week, stay tuned for some Fall Guys. And that'll do it. Overall, two thumbs up. The game still lives up to... Uh, what it delivered uh, the second time around and it brought back some fun and some raging all into one so <laughs> with that I want to thank you guys for watching I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you next week once when we start the DLC island of Cuphead have a good one I completely forgot to show you guys what happens if you say yes to the devil and uh, hand over the contracts. I mean, I know a lot of you have already seen it by now, obviously, because the game's been out long enough. But for those that haven't seen uh, this game, this is for you. So if you say yes and you hand over the contracts, you are mine now. And we're going to have a heck of a time down here. This is the alternate ending to Cuphead. You, uh, you hand over the contracts and you become pawns of the devil. It's, uh, not a, not the good ending. And as you can see, I got the achievement for selling out. So we're now playing the credits again. So that's it. That's all I wanted to show. Have a good one, guys.